an adult puppy friend to get ready for adoption to go home with a forever family and be happy. <laughs> okay, these puppies are so fun, but we should keep looking. Come on. Hi, friends, over here. Whoa, an orange slide. <laughs> Only one thing to do. <laughs> This is amazing! Puppies and slides, woo! <laughs> oh, check it out! Excuse me up there! Have you seen a dog named Penny? What's that? <laughs> do you do? <laughs> oh, look! <laughs> it's Penny! Okay. Let's keep looking for Penny. This is what she looks like. <laughs> Three, two, one, let's have some fun. <laughs> Ooh, yummy. This hamster's having a little snack. <laughs> Enjoy your lunch. Hey. Hi. I'm Mika, nice to meet you. I'm Lulu, nice to meet you. Hey, Lulu. Who's this? This is Carla, our cockatiel. Oh, hello, Carla. <laughs> She's having a quick snack break before her shower. Mm. Yeah, would you like to help me give her a shower? Sure. Okay, Carla, you ready for bath time? <laughs> squeeze, squeeze, pump. Tweet, tweet, tweet. La, 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 la. I love to sing in the shower. Does that mean she's all clean? Yeah, so this helps her, her <laughs> feathers stay dust free. It also helps her nares, which are like her nose area, oh. stay nice and clear of all those little nasty germs. Would you like to meet some of our other critters? <gasps> I'd love to. Great. <laughs> oh look, this friend has four legs, a hard shell, and walks very slow. Let's meet him. <laughs> okay, so this is our box turtle, Tommy. Hey, Tommy. We don't know how old he is, it's a mystery, but he's very <laughs> sweet and he kind of just runs the whole show here in Critter Corner. Um, he loves fruits and veggies as a snack, so I brought you a piece of broccoli Ooh. to feed him. <gasps> broccoli? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Looks like a little tree. Hey, Tommy, would you like some broccoli? Here you go. Yum, yum, yum. Enjoy your broccoli. Have a turtle-rific day! <laughs> All right, so this is our oh. California king snake, Sally. Hey, Sally. She's about two years old. Um, <laughs> would you like to meet her? I can bring her out. Okay. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna start from the back of the body. Uh-huh. And we're gonna gently grab her. Now, if she at any point wants to get off of me, that's totally fine. Here's Sally. Wow. Sally is so long. Oh yeah, she's a good girl. <laughs> Hi Sally, it's me, Mika. <laughs> she says hello, Mika. Oh, do you know what those colors are? Yeah, brown and beige. Oh, look at that long tongue. <laughs> oh yeah, so she's sniffing at her home. You see her tongue coming out? Yeah. She's like, this is my home, I'm gonna go back. Oh, he's nice and snug in there. Mm -hmm. She says, nice to meet you. Oh. Slither back home, Sally. Oh, yeah. <gasps> Who's that? This is Harvey. He's our hamster. He <laughs> is about two and a half years old, which is actually an adult age for hamsters. And this is his little home. Oh, looks so cozy. It is. <gasps> Wait, 
Is this what I think it is? It is. Check out this hamster wheel. <laughs> the hamster's running this round circle, round and around and around. Oh, I wish there was a human-sized hamster wheel. That could be really fun. <laughs> Lou loves that thing. I bet it looks like a great time. It is. <laughs> So this is Harvey's favorite activity. Would you like to see him roll around? Oh yeah. All right, so I'll let you see what he does. He already knows what to do. Oh, which way do I go? Which way do I go? Wee! This is his favorite activity. So he does it at least once a day, a couple times a week. Helps keep him uh, in shape and yeah. healthy. Great exercise. Yeah. <laughs> well, it was nice meeting you, friend. And I'll see you later, Lily. See you later. <laughs> <gasps> Check it out. My wish came true. <laughs> A giant hamster wheel. Ooh, I'll name it the Mika wheel and give it a try. Come on. <laughs> Treat for me. Hand it over. <laughs> Give it. Hello, friends. Would you like to play with this toy? Here you go. <laughs> hey. <laughs> Whoa. Hey, did you know kitty cats use their whiskers to help them see? Whoa, that's so cool. Yeah, they move around their whiskers to sense what's around them. Here you go. Do you like to play? <laughs> yeah! Oh, so cute. <laughs> hey, another fun fact is kitties, they can jump six times their height. That's really high, kitty cat. <laughs> Wait, I was supposed to be looking for Penny. That's right, let's keep looking. That means goodbye. <laughs> Over here. Check it out. It's the dog we've been looking for. Penny. <laughs> What's that? She's right behind me? Oh, let's go meet her. Hello, Penny. I'm Mika. Nice to meet ya. <laughs> Here she comes. Hey, Lulu. Hi. Okay, so you wanna meet Penny? Yeah, is it okay if I pet her? Yeah, so the first rule is to always ask the handler if it's okay to meet your dog. Very important. And then you're gonna get down to their level, see? Now we're at the same level. You're gonna <laughs> offer Penny your hand so she can sniff you, get to know you. <laughs> I think she likes me. And then you can get two fingers like this and then go down her back. Oh, wow! Oh, what? <laughs> She's so friendly. But remember, it's important to ask the adult with the dog if it's okay to pet and how they like to be pet. Yes. Does Penny like scratches? She does like scratches and she prefers to be pet under the chin, not over the head. Oh, that's a little scary. Okay, may I pet you under your chin? Oh yeah, lots of scratches. <laughs> oh, you're so sweet, Betty. Oh, 
Prefer under here. Yes, right. under the chin. There you go, much better. Do you want to help me put on her dot me vest? Sure, she looks ready to go. Perfect, do you have treats on here or do you need some? I do, I have some in my jam pack. Perfect, you can feed her treats. Hey Penny, I have a treat for you. Ooh. Yeah, such a good dog. <laughs> Perfect. Do you want to clip the bottom one? Yes, please. All set under your belly. All done. <gasps> okay, can I take her outside? Yes. There you go. <laughs> Come on, Penny, let's go play. <laughs> Bye, Penny. <laughs> See ya. Hey, I think I have something for you, Penny, in my jam bag. Oh. <laughs> Do you like a treat? Would you like a treat, Penny? Go get the treat! Oh, good girl. <laughs> I hope you're happy with your new family. It was so nice getting you ready today, Penny. <laughs> <laughs> hey, did you know that a dog's nose is just like our fingerprints? Yeah. Just how no two people have the same fingerprints no two dogs have the same nose. <laughs> Whoa. Oh, that was so much fun. I hope Penny and her new family are very, very happy. Well, that's the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? <laughs> M-E-E-K-A-H. Mika. Okay, friends. Bark. See you later. <laughs> me, Mika, and today I'm at the Lang Foundation in Los Angeles, California. And here, you can adopt a dog or a cat, and then they can be part of your family. Oh, there's a dog right there. Oh, hi, I'm Mika. Hi, I'm Megan. Hi, Megan, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too, this is Willow. Oh, hi, Willow. Oh, it's always important to ask before you pet an animal. Uh, can I pet Willow? Yes, you can. Okay. So just Crouch down so you're on her level uh -huh. and put your fist out so she can okay. smell you. Willow, Willow. Oh, what do you think? Aww. <laughs> so sweet. Well, are there more animals inside? There are. Oh, let's go check them out. So what is this little one's name? This is Sprout. <gasps> Sprout, what a cute name. Hi, Sprout. I have some treats for Sprout. Sprout allowed to have a treat? Yes, he okay. is. Let's see, you want a treat? You think Sprout likes treats? Oh, <laughs> <laughs> can we bring Sprout down to the ground and yeah. see if Sprout will want to play with us? Aw. Whoa, cool squeaky toy. It's a pink snake. <laughs> so once someone adopts an animal, what do they need to take care of the animal? Yeah, so for dogs, they need a leash, a collar, a harness, um, food, bowls, uh, and a lot of toys. Whoa! Food, bowls, toys. It's a lot of work to take care of an animal. It they is. need a lot of things. Aww, and is it different for cats? Yeah, so cats would need um, also food, bowls, uh, litter box, litter. Um, some good things to scratch on. Oh yeah, cats love to scratch. And a safe <laughs> carrier in case you need to take them to the vet. Oh wow. So you get a lot of things once you adopt an animal here. Yes, yes, we give people some of the food that they've been eating, um, some toys. And where do you get all of these toys? They have so many fun things to play with here. We get a lot of it donated. Oh, people yeah? have extra supplies, they donate them to us, and yeah, it's a big help for us. Whoa, what a great idea to donate toys for these dogs and cats to play with. <laughs> oh, what's this toy? Where did these animals come from? So we rescue these animals from city shelters. Uh, basically, the shelters are crowded with animals, so we take them and find them new homes. Oh, that's really nice. And if someone wants to adopt an animal, what do they do? So we would have them come in and meet some of the animals. They'd fill out an application, and we would help them find the right animal that matches their family. Wow, that's awesome!
It's so fun to play with cats and dogs, but it's also important to remember you have to take very special care of them. Whoa! Come look at this dog! Whoa, what kind of dog is this? This is an American Bully mix. American Bully mix? Whoa! This is a bigger dog. Aww! And she's so loving. What's her name? Uh, her name is Lady. Hi, Lady! Aww! So, so sweet. What's this? A blue... <gasps> Like a little mouse with a super long tail. <laughs> Aww. This dog is so cool. Ooh, and I love the purple leash. One of my favorite colors. Love your leash. Oh, and what's on her belly here? Yeah, so she's definitely had a litter of puppies. Wow, a litter of puppies? That's so cool. How many puppies do you know? Um, I don't, but I think they can have up to 10 puppies. Whoa, that's a lot of puppies. Wow. Oh, well, it was nice to meet you. Thanks for playing with us. Melissa's ready for her bandage change. Okay, great. Aww. Hi. So what room is this? So this is our medical treatment area. Oh, a medical treatment area. So this is where animals go to be taken care of if they're sick or they have, maybe they hurt themselves. What's wrong with her leg? So we rescued her with a broken leg. Aww. And yeah, now she has a cast on and she's healing. Oh, good. That must mean she's feeling better. She definitely is. Yeah, I can hear some purring there. She's purring really loud. Yeah, cats purr when they're in a great mood, right? Aww. And why is she wearing a big yellow flower? She looks super cute, and yellow is one of my favorite colors. <laughs> so that's an e-collar, and it keeps her from taking her bandage off. Oh, that's so smart and super cute. <laughs> are there other cats that we can see? There are. Oh, let's go see some more cats. Feel better. Cool. Welcome to the catio. Get it? Cat? Catio? It's the catio. <laughs> now they said that there are a lot of cats in here. Hmm. Will you help me find them? <laughs> awesome. Okay. Whoa. Look at all this. It kind of looks like something you would see at a playground. The cats can climb up here and they can scratch. <laughs> Come over here. Shh. I see a cat. Can you see it? Oh, it's sleeping. We found our first cat. Good job. Hmm. Oh, there's another cat over here. You see it? Hi, cat. That cat looks really soft. <laughs> and there's another cat. Hi, kitty. Wow, so we found one, two, three cats so far. <laughs> wow. Hmm. Do you see any other cats? <gasps> Come down here, all the way to the floor. There are two. Two cats in there. They're cuddling. I wonder if they're best friends. Oh. Hi. They're so cute. So we have one, two, three, four, five cats so far. I wonder if there's any more. Oh, wow. There's some water and some food in here. They take really good care of their cats. Hmm. Oh, look down here at these little boxes. See some blankets in here so the cats can be nice and comfy cozy. Oh, and look, it's a cutout of a cat face. That's cool. I don't see any cats though, do you? Hmm. Oh, I see one right here. Oh my goodness. Shh, this cat is taking a cat nap. Whoa, it looks really comfortable. I wonder if cats 
have dreams. <laughs> so one, two, three, four, five, six cats. We found six cats. Thanks for finding cats with me. I wonder what else is here. Come on. Check it out. I'm in a cat room. This is where all the cats are hanging out, relaxing like this one. Whoa, hi, I'm Mika. This room is so cool. There's a tree in here. Whoa, I bet the cats like to scratch on the tree. Maybe they scratch their back on there. Oh yeah. <laughs> Whoa, and cool thing is to climb on. Look, a little cat toy, a little mouse. <laughs> what else is over here? Whoa, do you know what this is? This long yellow tube? The cats can climb up here and then climb through the tube. Maybe you've done something like that at a playground before. They must have so much fun here. And in each little cubby is where the cat can go and have a little nap. Any cats in here? Oh, there's a cat in there. I didn't even know that. Hi. Oh, there's two cats in there. I don't know if you can see. There's two cats just hanging out. Oh, a teddy bear. I wonder if cats like to cuddle with stuffed animals. That's so sweet. Aw. Well, I have a cat toy. Have you ever seen anything like this before? Let's see if some of these cats want to play with it, okay? Um, <laughs> anyone want to play with me today? What about you? <laughs> this cat's like, Please don't bother me, I'm trying to take a nap right now. Okay, understood, understood. Okay, hey look, there's big bowls of water here because it's important for cats to hydrate, just like us. Hey, something else that they can climb on. And look, these little holes, these little hidey holes that they can just get all comfy. Cats seem to nap a lot. <laughs> hey, Megan. Hey. Oh my goodness, who I is this? One more friend for you to see. This oh is Memphis. Oh my gosh, can I hold Memphis? Yes. Oh, look at this little kitten. How old is Memphis? He's eight weeks. Eight weeks? Just a little baby kitten. Wow, Memphis is brand new to the world. Oh, wait, is Memphis from Memphis? Um, I don't think so. I don't know how we got the name Memphis. Aww, it's a super cute name. So Memphis is only eight weeks old. What does Memphis usually do? Um, he plays with his two brothers. <gasps> you have two yeah, brothers? Yeah, two brothers. Oh, that's so fun. Wow, baby kittens are so teeny tiny. Aww, it's so nice meeting you, Memphis. Oh my goodness. You do such a good job taking care of all of these animals. Aw, thank you. Aw. <laughs> well, thanks for letting me hang out with you, Memphis. <laughs> that was so fun! Getting to hang out with dogs and cats today. We learned about how to take care of our pets and adopt them and make them part of our family. Oh, cats and dogs are so cool. Well, this is the end of this video, but if you wanna see more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Cool. M-E-E-K-A-H. Mika. <laughs> well, thanks for learning with me. See you next time, bye. Hi, it's me, Mika. And today I'm at Peter Weber Equestrian Center in Rolling Hills Estates, California. And I'm so excited because today we're going to feed and care for horses. And also, I heard there are some other animals here for us to meet. Come on, let's go explore. Howdy y'all, it's cowgirl Mika coming to check on my horses. This rootin' tootin' town needs someone to make sure all the animals are taken care of. And I'm the gal for that. 
<laughs> okay, let's go get the horses started on their daily routine. I've been given permission to feed all the animals here today. Can you help me? Oh, great, I've got my bucket. Come on, let's go. Bye, Bobby. Hey, buddy, I'm Mika. Nice to meet you. <gasps> Whoa, he must be so excited to meet me. Did you know you can tell a lot about a horse's mood by the way his ears are pointed? If they're pinned back, that means they're not feeling very friendly, so we should give them some space. But if they're forward, that means they're looking ahead and it's okay to pet them. Oh, look, his ears are pointed forward. He must be ready for us to pet. Let's go. Hi, buddy. Wow, he's so soft. Did you know that a horse can look at two different... Yeah, that's right, buddy. He's excited to eat. Did you know horses can pay attention to different things when their ears are pointed in different directions? That means they're focused on two different things at the same time. Buddy's ready to eat. Let's feed him. <laughs> What's in my bucket? What's for breakfast? Hmm, what do I have for you to munch and crunch? <gasps> Look, we have some carrots and some hay. Let's go. Are you ready, buddy? <laughs> wow. <laughs> Let's try some hay next. <gasps> Great job, pal. <gasps> Horses are herbivores, so they love to eat plants. Did you know horses don't have to brush their teeth? That's right. That's because their teeth keep growing and growing. And they never get too long because they just get whittled down when they eat. <laughs> really cool. <laughs> Buddy is a Palomino horse. Horses come in all different colors, like Appaloosa, Pinto, Paint, Black. I got it. Let's go on a ride and find a bay horse. Come on, let's go. Check out all these horses. Okay, first we'll park Buddy, and then we'll take a closer look. Great job, Buddy. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna dismount now. Now he's in. <gasps> wow, look at all these horses. They're so colorful. <gasps> Check out Happy. Hello, Happy. Is Happy a bay horse? No, Happy is an Appaloosa. <laughs> cool. Let's keep looking for our bay horse. Check this guy out. I wonder if he's a bay horse. Hi, are you a bay horse? No, that's a chestnut horse. Let's keep looking. <laughs> oh, I see another horse over there. Let's go see. Hello. <laughs> Are you a bay horse? Oh, no. That's a Palomino, just like Buddy. Okay, one more. Is this a bay horse? That's right. It is a bay horse. <laughs> Hello. I'm here to take care of you. <laughs> Let's walk him over to his stall. There we go. All right, we're ready. Come on. <laughs> now that we're here, we should check his stall. It's important to keep a horse's stall clean from manure and mud so they don't get sick. <laughs> wow, it's spotless. Great job keeping your room clean. <laughs> Just kidding. Now it's time for some grooming. I'll grab my brush. Wow. It's important to clean off any dirt that might bother them under their saddle. We can also check for any injuries he might have gotten overnight. 
Great. Did you know that horses can run right after being born? That's incredible. It takes humans a lot longer to learn how to run. First, we learn how to roll over and then sit up and then crawl and then walk and then run. But horses can do it right away. That's so impressive. Must be because their legs are so strong. Do you need any lunch? No, you've already eaten? Okay, guess my work here is done. See you later. Let's go check out what other animals we can feed. Oh. Wow! Check out this petting corral. Let's see what kind of animals are inside for us to care for. Follow me. Whoa! There are so many animals. I see goats and alpacas. Oh, there's even a chicken. Let's see if they need some food. Come on in. Hello. Hi, I'm Mika. Nice to meet you. <laughs> oh, it looks like he's ready. Have you had any food? That means, yep, I'm all full. <laughs> What's in my bucket? I grab my brush so your hair can be nice and plush. <laughs> okay, he's ready. Let's start brushing. <laughs> brushing is important because it loosens any loose hair and dandruff from their hair. Mm-hmm. That helps keep their blood flow nice and healthy. There you are, friend. Great job. <laughs> You're all clean. You look great. My job is done here. Wow, bunny rabbits. Let's hop inside. Hop, hop. Keep hopping. <laughs> Check out all these bunny rabbits. <laughs> What's in my bucket? What's for lunch? What do I have for you to munch and crunch? <laughs> oh, lettuce. Bunnies are herbivores. That means they like to eat plants. And they're very social too, so they like to live in groups. Let's count how many bunny rabbits we see. One, two, three. Three bunny rabbits. Oh, they're so soft and cuddly. <laughs> and bunny rabbits, their teeth, they just keep growing just like horses. But it gets whittled down after they eat. <laughs> Well, our rabbits are all fed. Let's go see what other animals we can find. Oh, look at these tortoises. They're so cool. Are you ready for some lunch? <laughs> yes, I got you. What's in my bucket? What's for lunch? What do I have for you to munch and crunch? Whoa, he started early. That's right, it's lettuce. A tortoise's shell is really tough to protect them. They can put their head, arms, and legs inside like a cozy little home. <laughs> and these shapes, they're called scutes. Oh, that's a lot of scutes. Now that the tortoises are fed, I'll just scoot on out of here. Success! All the animals are fed, groomed, and taken care of. Thanks for helping me, friend. <laughs> that was so much fun meeting Buddy and all those cute bunnies, tortoises, and goats. They're all fed and ready for their day. Well, that's the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Can you spell my name with me? M-E-E-K-A-H. Mika. All right, y'all. See you later. Bye-bye. Whoa. <laughs> I'm up so high. Hello. Over here! Hello! Oh, there's a slide!
right. I'll meet you at the bottom. Hi. Three, two, one. Yay. <laughs> Hi, it's me, Mika. And today I'm at Twinkle Play Space in Brooklyn, New York. I'm so excited because there's lots of fun things to do here. Oh, look down here. This looks like something a doctor would use. Maybe to check your reflexes? Whoa! <laughs> I'll just put this in my jam pack. And a thermometer. Something else a doctor might use. Interesting. Hmm, a clipboard? Maybe a doctor clipboard? And a stethoscope. Yeah, this is something a doctor uses to check your heartbeat. Boom, boom, boom. <laughs> There's a note. Dear Mika, Pettenville needs someone to take care of its animal friends. Here is your veterinarian kit. I know you'll do a great job. Signed, Mayor Rooster. Oh, that's so cool. I get to take care of animals. That's what a veterinarian or a vet does. They're so important because they're animal doctors who take care of animals. Oh, look over here. A doctor's coat. Let's try it on. Wow, I look like a real animal doctor, huh? <laughs> oh, first on the list is a dragon. We better go find it. Come on. Whoa, check it out. A really big, cool looking dragon. Hi, dragon. Oh, it's a mama dragon. Look at the four dragon babies up there. Let's see what the problem is. Hi, I'm Dr. Mika. What's the problem? Hey, I can't laugh. What? You can't laugh? Oh, that must be so frustrating. I love to laugh. Hmm, let me see if I can help. Let me just check your heartbeat. Dun, 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 dun. Ooh, I like that beat. Heartbeat sounds nice and strong. Hmm, what are some ways you can make someone laugh? Maybe some silly dance moves. Uh, okay, Mama Dragon, check this out. Nothing? Tough crowd. Hmm. Well, maybe there's something wrong with your throat. I'll take these scarves. We'll go in here, up the dragon's throat, and out. Maybe that will tickle the dragon, and the dragon can laugh. Let's try. patient. <laughs> wow, we did it. Thank you so much for your help. <laughs> Have fun laughing. Okay, next animal. Come on. Wow, what a beautiful tree. <gasps> Look, cute little birds. Hi, I'm Dr. Mika. How are you feeling today? Oh, they said they feel fine, but they need their checkup. Have you ever been to the doctor for a checkup? Yeah, just to make sure everything is good and nice and healthy. Come here, little bird. Oh, so sweet. Tweet, 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 tweet. <laughs> okay, the first thing I'm gonna do is check your temperature. Okay, let's see, I think I have a thermometer in here. Yep, here it is. Just gonna put it under your wing. Stay still for me. Mm -hmm. Yes. Perfect temperature. That's really good. Okay, let's see what else we can check here. How about your eyes? Look at me. Keep going. Look, 
There we go. All right. <gasps> nice. Ooh, healthy eyes. You must eat a lot of healthy food. All right, now we're just gonna check your brother over here. What healthy birds we have here. Keep up the good work, eat healthy and stay strong. Tweet, tweet, tweet. <laughs> Whoa, check it out. This is a vet's office. Animals can come here to get some extra care if maybe they're not feeling well or they're sick. Oh, look, this is a cool place to give an animal a bath, make it nice and clean. Oh, these are bird cages. Cool. Oh, don't see any birds in there though. Hmm. <gasps> I do see some animals over here. Oh my goodness. <gasps> Look at this little kitty cat. It's sleeping. Shh. <laughs> oh, this cat's awake. Hi, cat. Do you want to come out and say hi? Aw. Meow. Meow. Oh, how are you feeling? Much better. Oh, I'm so happy. Do you want to rest a little longer? Mm -hmm. Okay, I'll put you back. Okay. Aw. There you go. Have a nice rest. <laughs> Do you know what animal this is? Yeah, it's a horse. Yay, yay. Hi horse, I'm Dr. Mika. How are you feeling today? Much better, yay. Oh good, <laughs> I'll put you back so you can rest too. Aw, <gasps> another sleeping animal. It's a little puppy. Look at its little nose. So cute. Did you know that dogs can smell really well? Yeah, they have wet noses. Have you ever noticed a dog's nose? If you touch it, it feels a little wet. Because smells stick better to wet noses than dry noses. And a dog could smell a human over 40 feet away, or about 12 meters. That's really, really far away. Isn't that cool? Oh, shit. Isn't that cool? <laughs> oh, do you know what animal this is? It's a rabbit! <laughs> Look at its long ears. Hello? <laughs> oh, I think this rabbit needs to rest too. There you go. Aw, all these animals are resting. It's really important to rest, especially if you don't feel very well. Look, a little pig. Oink, oink, oink. <laughs> Look how cute. How are you feeling today, pig? Oh, that's great. The pig said it's feeling a lot better. Oh, good. I'm so glad. Well, everyone rest up, and I'm going to go look for some other animals who might need my care. You come with me? Let's go. We're on a farm! Wow, there's lots of farm animals in here. Huh. A chicken and little chicks. Hi! <laughs> They're so cute. <gasps> Three new patients! Let's see. Hi, I'm Dr. Mika. How are you? <laughs> oh, <laughs> I understand, cow. The cow is saying that it's feeling a little lonely. Aw, well, looks like your x-ray is on the wall. Let's take a check. All right, looks like, uh-huh, correct. Yep, that's the one. Oh yeah, you look great. Your x-ray is actually perfect. But you said you're lonely, hmm. You know, they say that cows have best friends. <laughs> yeah, they have a favorite cow that they like to hang out with all the time. So I bet you need a cow friend. Hmm, do you see any cows around here? No. <gasps> Did you hear that? I think it's coming from inside. Oh yeah. <gasps> Look at this sweet cow. No. Do you want a best friend? Oh, I have a great friend for you. Come on. Here you are. Best friends, best friends. Aw. <laughs> Do you feel better? No. <laughs> awesome.
awesome. I'm so glad. Did you hear that? It sounded like a cat in trouble. Oh no, there's a cat stuck way up there. I have to save it. Come on. Whoa, a fire truck. Ah, yeah, firefighters help cats get out of really high places all the time. Looks like I need to save a cat. Here we go. I'm coming for you, cat. Hi, cat. It's me, Dr. Mika. Let me see if I can get you unstuck. Oh, are you okay? Oh, well, I have you now. Let's go back down the ladder. How are you feeling? Oh, oh there's a fire. I better become a firefighter and put it out. Whew. Close one. You know what? I think I'll take you to the vet's office and check your heartbeat and make sure you're A-OK. -okay. Come on, meow. <laughs> OK, little cat, welcome to my office. Let me just give your heartbeat one more listen, OK? All right, make sure it's a nice, strong heartbeat. OK, let's listen. Bum, 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 bum. Bum, bum. Oh, sounds perfect. <laughs> nice, strong heartbeat. Okay, well, you've had a really long day, so I think maybe you should get some rest. What do you think? Yeah, I agree. Come on, let's see if there's any open spots for you to lay down and take it easy. All right, here you go. Get nice and cozy and take a little rest. It's important to get rest, especially when you're not feeling well. <laughs> well, I had so much fun today taking care of those animals. Thank you so much for your help. And isn't it cool that dogs can smell so well and that cows have best friends? Oh, that's so cute. <laughs> well, this is the end of this video, but if you wanna watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Awesome. <laughs> M-E-E-K-A-H, Mika. All right, I'll see you next time. Mika the Vet, out. <laughs> Bye.